The amount of federal student aid a student receives can make a big difference when it comes to choosing a college. WHE's Naomi Hilmer is on your side tonight showing how the new FAFSA application is impacting that milestone decision. Naomi. Lori, Bo, the Department of Education rolled out a new FAFSA process back in December, three months after students typically start applying. What was meant to make the process easier between the shortened time frame and some significant changes made to the form, it has caused more roadblocks for counselors as they advise students for post-graduation. Yes, the simplification has been good, when it works. With this year's change to the FAFSA system, high school seniors must wait longer to make an informed college decision. Families don't know what to expect in terms of what it's going to cost their child to attend the school because none of that information has been able to come to the families yet. Because the application was distributed late, it hasn't left much time for counselors, parents, and students alike to adjust to the changes and the subsequent errors that come with it. It's, you know, I've had a student who here's a good example a student who has been raised by grandparents so he thought the grandparents had guardianship guardianship is very different from custody so he answered guardianship well that's not correct and he can't show the documentation but he can't go back in and fix that yet Students will not be able to fix errors in the system until late March, a time most colleges would already have their FAFSA data. At this point in March, we would have data from student FAFSAs for fall of 2024, but we are now expecting that to maybe not be until the end of April. This has made some colleges push back decision dates, but some larger colleges have not. If a student is having difficulties submitting a FAFSA, then that could really change what schools they decide to pursue if, if a school has an earlier deadline. And since there has also been changes for what qualifies for federal aid. The families who are impacted are the ones who often have the least resource that have more barriers in terms of language, um, family support, um, so it's it's been really hard for that group. And Pellissippi State says although it may take a bit longer, they are confident in being able to award financial aid to their fall 2024 students. And counselors are hopeful most colleges will show grace as students use this new system.